Endogain is one of the best documented products in uh, Peronto regeneration. When I started my, my studies, then we were not sure what we can accomplish with this material. And the most important indication is the treatment of intraboni defects, periodontal intraboni defects. And for this specific indication, we have the best possible evidence. The wound healing is also an important aspect because after peronto surgery, with addition of endogain, the healing is always excellent. We have a bunch of evidence about endogain in various indications in surgical treatment, intraboni defects, furcations, but also recession coverage and supraalveolar type of defects. We know that it promotes formation of cementum, peronta ligament and alveolar bone. It has also a certain antibacterial property and has a positive effect on soft tissue healing. In other words, it helps soft tissue wound healing. We know a lot. However, we know that we have a kind of protein cocktail and uh, it would be nice to focus more on different applications or new applications such as maybe non-surgical applications around teeth, maybe even around implants and to see whether we can have a new indication for this product especially in areas that are quite tricky to treat and where up till now we don't have defined clinical protocols like for example treatment of infections around uh, implants. I think that Endogain has a huge potential in improving wound healing in different types of defects. Of course around teeth, probably also around implants and we have some new data suggesting that some novel applications like maybe in the frame of a non-surgical approach may have a positive effect on soft tissue wound healing. And I think this is an exciting new area that should be researched in the near future. Or maybe to improve the outcomes after minimally invasive surgery. I think that it's important first of all to understand the biology behind, to read the studies and to have a very stringent protocol, to select the right patient, always to use the product for the right indication and to follow the strict intra-operative protocol but also the maintenance phase and to be aware that we need to have a treatment plan and to integrate this part of the regenerative therapy in the overall treatment concept. I think um, this is the right statement. Based on the evidence, we can state this. It is a biologic concept that was implemented into the clinical application and it has a huge evidence both from preclinical and also clinical studies and the follow-up of up to 20 years. So I would say that uh, besides guided tissue regeneration, Endogain is the gold standard because I think that among the biologic materials is definitely the best documented material with the most solid evidence. So I can recommend it to every clinician that starts to work on peronta regeneration.